Sir Nicholas, our house ghost, is looking for you. You can find him near the Great Hall. Thou can't it? imagine how, how inconvenient. Do you even comprehend how expensive that room was? Breaking your own belongings is one thing. But that room belonged to your sister, and I'll have you know that she is beside herself. Never mind it. One that's a too many. I no more room rating for you. Incendio. Rebellion. Incendio. Rebellion. Rebellion. One boy fell off his broom during my flying class. Good thing Kagawa was there to catch him. She's very good at arresting momentum. Incendio. Hey, it's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing, Wisby-inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, 
I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing whisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Sounds simple enough, and who wouldn't want to go to Honey Dukes? Ah, brilliant. Thank you. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. I'll need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, you there! Uh, yes, you! I wonder if you might uh, come with me for a moment. Revelio. Revelio. This looks like the right statue. What's the password? Descendium. Goodness. Who knew this was all down here? How I get down. Looks broken though. Repair. That seems to have done the trick. Rebellion. Castle will never cease to surprise me. Incendium.
Incendio. Rebellion. Leviosa. Repair. Leviosa. Rebellion. Incendio. Way of that platform. Accio. Levioso. Aha. Got it. Revelio. Be the way out. I need to find a way to open that gate. Revelio. Send you. Something smells sweet. Must be close to honeydew. than Hogsmeade. Honeydukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Revelio.
Revelio. Revelio. Revelio. Rebellion. Hello again. Were you able to get to Honeydukes? Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them? Incredible. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. You I... wanted to see me, sir? Yes, Sir Nicholas de Mimsy Porpington, at your service. Nice to meet you, Sir Nicholas. I know about the book you found and its missing pages. I may be able to help. Follow me, if you will. It's not too far. Wait, how do you know about the book? 
and that it's missing pages. Word gets around amongst the ghosts. You were spotted with Mr. Sallow in the restricted section. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. This may be a leap, but I believe I know who ended up with those pages. I'd be happy to take you to him, if you'd be so kind as to perform a small favor for me along the way. Hmm, a small favor in exchange for getting those pages. Yes, it's, it's nothing really. I'd be grateful if you could simply go into the kitchen and procure a little rotten roast beef. I beg your pardon. Roast beef. Rotten roast beef. That is correct. Rotten roast beef. If one floats through it just right, one can almost taste it. Mm. Ugh. I suppose I can do that. But why me? It's simple, my young friend. My ghostly form cannot carry it. Rebellion. Now, if you'd be so kind as to collect the roast beef, I shall explain everything else in due course. Revelio. Ah, here we are. Tickle the pear and head on in. Did you say tickle the pear? Uh, do try. <sighs> I'm already imagining the sweet aroma of rotten roast. Never In will the understand kitchen. students. What could they Plenty want? Of delicious food. Found themselves a bit peckish, likely. You know Certainly how makes rookies job. Rebellion. Hello. Can you point me in the direction of the rubbish? Towards the other end of the kitchen. If it's not taken out yet, just follow your nose. You'll find it soon enough. Treat. Delicious. Revelio. It's 
smells good. Here's a welcome treat. Delicious. Hmm. Here's some beef, but it's not rotten. I'd best keep looking. Ugh, oh, there's a disgusting smell. I must be getting close. Oh, a student? What a treat! What can Finky get for you? A pumpkin pasty? Perhaps some Welsh rabbit? Sounds lovely, but what I really need is this rotten roast beef. Is it all right for students to wander into the kitchens? Well, since you asked, students aren't so... There's nothing that lifts thinking. We so rarely get visitors, and we have plenty. It was nice to meet you. Thank you for the beef. Happy to help, and to meet you as well. Please give Nick Finky's regards. There's nothing like a meal prepared by a house elf. Rebellion! You're back! No trouble, I take it? Not at all. Finky sends her regards, along with the rotten roast beef. Ah, glad to hear it. Kind elf, Finky. Now, let's get that beef to Sir Patrick Delaney Podmore, and you'll be one step closer to finding those pages. This is all rather cryptic, Sir Nicholas. What's going on? Terribly sorry. I'm getting ahead of myself. Sir Patrick organises the Headless Hunt, a group of headless ghosts who gather for various, uh, head... Headless active? Uh, yes, uh, you'll see. My plan, uh, shall we? I thought the rotten roast beef was for you. It is, uh, in a way, offering the beef to... Very well. Ah, wonderful. Do stay behind me. It's Sir Patrick we want. Oi, Nesta, look who's here. What have we told you, nearly headless Nick? Hello, Sir Amzet. Do let us pass. We've brought a little something for Sir Patrick. Probably going to try to beg his way in again. <laughs> <laughs> Do they always talk to you like that? Oh, all in good fun. Once Sir Patrick lets me join the headless hunt, I'll be right there with them. This offering is sure to win him over. Uh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. Rest assured, you'll have your information from young Jackdaw in no time. Wherever he may be. What I'd give for a flagon of mead or a nice leg of lamb right about now. Then this party would be complete. How about the next best thing, Sir Patrick? Ah, Sir Nicholas. And a student. Who let you in? Eh, uh, we brought you a gift. This is all very suspicious. What do you really want? As if I need to ask. Um, it, it's Richard Jackdaw. Uh, where can we find him? Uh, may we speak to him? Jackdaw, eh? Why, here he is now. What a shame. Without his head. I bet you've always wondered what that's like, eh, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> uh, sir, you jazz. <sighs> it's bound to be around here somewhere. Probably being used in a game. If you find it, I give you my permission to speak with him, my young model. 
It's the least I can do for you for bringing this putrescent gift home. Uh, sir, there's another matter I wish to discuss with you, if I may. Tut, tut, Sir Nicholas. How many times do I have to tell you? Our entry requirements are quite clear. <laughs> but, sir, I... Uh, we aren't the headless except for a little bit of tendon hunt, after all. Now, please, follow me and I shall help you find your way out. Farewell, my young friend. Perhaps your luck with these chaps will be better than mine. My mortal life was never this entertaining. A map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Who will be next to play our little game of hide and seek amongst the pumpkins? Hello again. Can you help me? Ah, Sir Nicholas's young friend. Has he abandoned you? Not at all. I need to speak to Richard Jackdaw. Sir Patrick said his head might be around here somewhere. Indeed it might be. Hmm. It is a bit unorthodox to include a mortal. But if you do wish to speak with him... Oh, why not? You can speak with Jackdaw if you can find his head amongst these pumpkins. Not just once, but five times. Good old Gumfrey will move the head to a different spot each time you find it. Those are the rules. What say you? If that's what I need to do to speak to Jackdaw, I'll do it. Marvellous! Of course, a mortal holding a wand has an advantage over us ghosts. You can simply blast away to your heart's content. Remember, the game's not over until you find him five times. Begin! Cast away! It won't be long now. Rebellion. We'll find him. Accio! Is that already? Looks like we need to find another pumpkin to hide it, eh, Jack Dawson? Whatever Rebellion. you say, Dumfrey, this is not my finest moment. Levioso! Accio! Why did I come back here? Rebellion. Who would have thought a mortal would be so good at this? You've almost got him. Accio! Levioso! Incendio! Here we go again. Revelio! Oh, Accio! I did this plan! Revelio! Let me go, sir. Accio. Is it over yet? Are we still going? Revelio. It won't be long now. We'll find him. Revelio. I thought a mortal would be so good at this. You've almost got him. Well done. Of course, having a wand served you well. Still, I believe congratulations are in order. Not too bad for a mortal. Now, say what you need to say to old Jack Dorier. here, hmm? You've earned it. Nicely done. But, what's going on? You're not a member of the Headless Hunt. No, I'm not. Merlin's beard. I know precisely... The map on those pages led me to my demise. I was not ready for what awaited me in that cave. The pages are likely still mouldering away with my... Uh, uh, remains. Quite a fight. The pages are what... Yes. <sighs> Say... 
What will I find in the cave? Aside from my mortal remains? If I remember correctly, some treasures, a magical bridge. But what kind of an adventure would it be if I spoiled the surprises for you? I need those pages, so I suppose I'd better meet you. Thank you. Not to worry. I'll just need to be reunited with my body first. But Dumfrey can handle that. See you at the forest's edge. Rebellion. Told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Rude and Peck said a customer lost a deeracle around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got us in a lot of trouble. We're very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Uh, instead, I just wasted our time. There you are. Huh. Finally. I have enough for that wind uh, Well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Never mind, I'll fix it, as always.
Revelio. Revelio Accio Levioso Accio Rebellion. Incendio. Rebellion. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Incendio. Incendio. Revelio. Lumos. Accio. Revelio. Accio. Revelio. Levioso. Lumos. Revelio. 
Reparel. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Revelio. Incendio! Revelio! Incendio. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Revelio. Revelio. Lumos. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. Handy Revelio. indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Levioso. Accio. Incendio.
here. Let me also. Incendio. Who lived here, I wonder? You're gonna regret coming here. Better be your face. Akio. Incendio. You interfere with us and that's right. Incendio. Do you believe I defeated an Ashwinder by myself? Levioso! Accio! <laughs> Incendio! Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Just like a Gryffindor to brave the Forbidden Forest in pursuit of adventure. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Simply take the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Ah! 
Ortega! Stupid one. Levioso! Akio! Incendio! Stupid one. Levioso! Stupid one. Incendio! Stupid one. Akio! Surprisingly, as good as his word. Revelio. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. from home. Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. <laughs> Let me open. Akio. Incendium. You'll pay for that! Incendium. No! Let me open. Akio. I won't rest. No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack has led me. I wonder how big this...
symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. Revelio. I wonder if any of my spells have helped me through this. Let me know, Incendio. Good day again, stupid one. I'm not going to touch those. Look! Akio! Incendio! Incendio! Get you! Diego! Stupid! Akio! Stupid! Rebellion. Float straight to me. Akio. Richard Jack. Something behind for me, but where could he be? Akio! Huh. 
Revelio. Revelio. Not a headless skeleton in sight. But I may as well help myself to this. Revelio. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of it. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind me, but where could he be? Incendio. 
not a headless skeleton in sight. But I may as well help myself to this. Incendio! 